This question is suggested by one of our followers. And the question goes like this. This figure contains a right triangle, an isosceles right triangle. Now let's draw two segments, wherein this angle measures 45 degrees. Now this length measures 6 units, and this segment measures 8 units. Now the goal in this question is to find the value of this segment, x. Now you can pause this video if you want to give this problem a try. Now suppose you pause this video, now let's see if you got the correct answer. Alright, so given this figure, our goal is to find the length of this segment, x. And to answer this question, we will use this concept, the side angle side postulate. Now it says, if two sides and an included angle are congruent, then the two triangles are congruent. So we will use this concept to answer this question or to find the value of this side x. Now, what we're going to do is to use the given information. So we have an isosceles right triangle. So all of the acute angle is 45 degrees for sure. Next, let's call this angle be equal to alpha and this angle be equal to beta. Why not? And take note, alpha plus beta adds up to 45 degrees because this angle adds up to 90 degrees. We will use this concept later on. So alpha plus beta is 45 degrees. Now let's focus on this triangle in the bottom part. And what I'd like to do is to flip this triangle to this point like this in such a way that this angle right over here is the alpha. This angle is 45 degrees, and this side is 8 units. And also, this segment is congruent. These two are congruent, right? Now, 45 plus 45 degrees, this is 90 degrees for sure. And now at this point, we can now create a right triangle by connecting this point to this point. And... The legs are 6 and 8, and the hypotenuse, if we get the hypotenuse, we get 10 units. So using Pythagorean triple, 6, 8, 10. Or we can use the Pythagorean theorem, a squared plus b squared equals c squared. You can replace the legs a and b with 6 and 8. Now, 6 squared is 36, and 8 squared is 64. Now, 36 plus 64, this will end up to 100. Now, get the square root of 100 we get that the value of C is 10. So the hypotenuse is 10. Now, let's focus on this triangle right over here. So what do we know in this triangle? We know this angle right over here is alpha plus beta. And alpha plus beta, we know earlier that this is 45 degrees. So we can replace this alpha plus beta with 45 degrees. Also take note that these two segments are congruent. Now, we have these two triangles and we have the same side like over here. Now, using the concept of side angle side postulate, we have two congruent sides with an included angle of 45 degrees and this side, which is equal to both. Therefore, these two triangles are congruent. Therefore, this x measures 10 units also. And that is our answer to this question. Therefore, given this figure, then the value or the length of this segment x is 10 units and as always we are done